Hi, my name's Melissa. I thought I'd do a little video to help you perhaps get along in your tarot card project. So I found a little sample here, which I've opened up in Photoshop over here, which looks kind of cool. So then I went and tried to find other images that might work as a little mock-up project. And I found this ghostly, creepy girl, which that kind of works for me. And so over here, I went and, you know, um, changed some of the levels here. Get that right. And then I match the image size to the tarot card so it would have the right dimensions. Get that there. And then I paste it in and oh, oh I'd opened up my other elements here and I found this skull, which kind of is representative of this skull here. Not nearly as cool. And uh, but here it is. So I went through and did a little outline here, and then I'm just gonna go control or command C to copy that, and then I go back here. Command V to paste it in there. Command T to make it a little better, bigger, I mean. And then however it is that you would want to go about doing this, and then you could make layers, make it different so it stands out, however you really need to do it. This is just a very brief demo on how to gather elements online to put into an assembly with a reference of some sort. Were I to go further with this, I would uh, go find different stuff for the floor in the background and create this uh, Roman numeral text, and then these other designs would come by some other meaning. I'm not sure how I would do that, but um, I'd figure it out. And that's the thing. All of these classes are really about teaching you how to figure out how to do this stuff on your own. It is difficult when you learn by different means than the way the class is intended, but hopefully this will be enough of a description to get you going if you're not already going already.